coverage of the 2018 TechCrunch Disrupt is brought to you by Galvanize TV. I'm Derek Rodriguez with Galvanize TV at TechCrunch Disrupt. Anton, you are our hundredth and final interview. We're excited to hear about your startup, which is Humanic. Could you please tell us more? Um, thank you very much. It's a pleasure being here. So what Humanic is, is a financial platform where we provide all possible financial services for people without the proper identification in emerging markets. Um, as estimated by the World Bank, there are more than two billion adults. They don't have access to the banking system um, due to many problems, identification or lack of it. It's just one of it. Um, so what we do is that we are providing them an opportunity to get paid and pay. And then how we do that? Well, we do that by creating digital identities using biometric piece. And then we also um, apply the blockchain piece just to tokenize assets because 95% of the transactions happen in cash in the countries where we operate. Um, so there's a lack of liquidity, which we solve by digitizing assets. But the most important piece of this aspect is just literally providing access to online jobs, online education, and obviously marketplaces. So that's where people locally, so um, on a local level, state level, you know, global level, they can actually exchange or sell, buy, and then you name it. So products, services, goods, everything that, you know, everything pretty much that they, they, they can. Um, so ultimately, you know, combining all of that together, there's a simple problem. People can't get paid in the country where, where they are without the proper identification. We try to solve it. That's, yeah. that's what we do. And at Galvanize, creating jobs and access to ed education is very important to us. Uh, what are some success stories that you could share? Uh, I have tons of them, actually. Um, so one of the, one of the latest people uh, that I talked to is the guy in Dar es Salaam, um, Tanzania. Uh, well, so what he's doing on our, on our platform is that he's actually finding the clients where he would deliver the food to the offices, like, you know, lunch or like breakfast. So that's the way he's making the money. Um, there's also a very, very interesting, um, I would say, a syndicate of women in Ghana. And then they do like handmade bracelets, uh, you know, the jewelry. So we, we were one of their first clients. Um, there are many, there are literally like thousands of like, you know, success stories, I would call, because... Um, you know, there's so many different things that people do, like you know, on, on like their like freelance whole platform, from you know, like building um, things, so building services again, like delivering stuff. Uh, people are even there's a service, and what they do, they stand in the lineups for the people, right? So you'd pay, and then the person will stay in the lineup for you. Um, so there are crazy ideas like that, and then they will work. Sure. Um, so what we are, our task here is, is just to provide all important uh, functionality for those guys, and that's just literally making sure there's no scam, there's no fraud, and then people are being able you know, to get paid and pay. And then lastly, it's just literally the size of the ecosystem, because the more people there in the area, well, obviously, the higher the, the density is of the number of the people, the number of startups there, well, the richer the ecosystem is. So for us, it's just flourishing, um, you know, enlarging it on both sides. Yeah. And what are the next big steps that the world should be aware of? Um, so we are right now in 21 African countries. So we're only like African-based, uh, I would say, platform. For us, the next milestones would be, first of all, uh, expanding to 20 more countries. That's where we've done the legal due deal. Uh, so that's Latin America and then South Asia Pacific. And then the next piece is that, so we have now more than 450,000 active users on the platform. The next milestone is 1 million active users. Yeah. Um, now, it's always, you know, it's always very hard making like public statements, all right, so when would you achieve 1 million active users, right? But then looking at, you know, month to month growth rates, so that's something that we plan to do in like in the next six months, as well as expanding um, with 20 more countries. So those are the very critical milestones that we try to achieve. Congratulations. And lastly, do you have any advice for entrepreneurs? Uh, here's, here's a funny thing. So um, just recently, a couple of days ago, I read about the Tony Robinson. Um, he was giving um, like a motivational speech. I think it was like a lecture. Um, I think it was in Moscow, Russia. Anyways, and then one of the key things that he always says is just literally never stop trying. There's, there shouldn't be such thing in, in, like your, in, in your language or in your routine as like stop trying doing something. So if that's the only thing that I could tell to you know to an entrepreneur, just never stop trying. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very Check much. out Humanic. I'm Derek Rodriguez with Galvanize TV.